From its nature to the architecture. From the city's music to the overall lifestyle. Wine culture in Vienna is almost as old as the city itself. may not look like it, but we're still within Vienna city limits. That's because Vienna is the only city in the world with an active, large-scale wine-producing culture within its metropolitan area. We're starting our story at Nussberg, one of the many wine districts such as Stammersdorf, Biesenberg, Mauer, and others. Much of the wine that ends up being served at both local and international tables comes from these areas. This land, the very ground beneath me, is one of the main reasons why the city was originally settled. A part of Vienna's soul can be felt here. This is easily experienced by taking a hike. There are numerous multi-generational wine and sparkling wine producers here. That means families that have harvested grape continuously for hundreds of years. This seems like a good time to check the Ivy app. And right now, the Ivy app is telling me that there are no less than 155 different wine farms in the city. The beloved and ancient tradition of winemaking is being sustained by young vintners such as Jutta Ambrosic. This tradition revolves around white grapes, such as Riesling and Grüne Vetlina. But lovers of the red have great options too, such as Zweigelb, Blaufränkisch and Pinot Noir as well. Perhaps its most famous wine of the minute, and the one that some say perfectly sums up the Viennese spirit, is the Gemischte Satz, a combination of different grapes harvested and pressed together that end up creating a completely unique taste and inimitable character. Like I mentioned, there are many, many stores and restaurants worldwide that sell great Viennese wines. But to truly experience Vienna wine culture, you gotta come to one of these. Buschenschank, so named after the bundle of twigs or Buschen, which decorates its front door, are wine cellars or gardens that open only on special days during the year. They open to the public and serve plates of cured meats, bread, cheeses, and various spreads. I've got my friends Paul and Soya here with me, and I asked them to join me because you cannot talk about Viennese wine without sharing the experience with friends. Paul is drinking a Heurige. Technically, the word Heurige is a short way of meaning this year's. Before this year's wine is created, it first begins as most, before fermenting into Sturm, both of which also produce their own unique flavor and have become popular seasonal drinks. But beyond the wine, the word Heurige has come to be known as a specific wine tavern itself. The allure of the Heurige lays in its comfortable and intimate charm an atmosphere created during its 18th century origins, when Emperor Josef II decreed that everyone was allowed to sell wine and juices out of their homes. Over time, food was also allowed to be served, and although the menu expanded, the atmosphere of living room comfort remained, and the quintessential quality of Viennese Gemütlichkeit was established. Today, Heurige wine taverns can remain open year-round and serve their wine alongside warm, homemade meals. I actually will always come to Heurige because I deeply love fresh vineyard grape juices and syrup spritzers and all of the other yummy non-alcoholic beverages that Heurige actually also have on option. Both the Heurige, as well as the Buschenschank, have an atmosphere that's hard to compare to any other eating or drinking tradition in the world. But if I had to compare it, I would say that it slightly resembles the Spanish tapas culture. 
in the way that the feeling of community and sharing food and drink is just as important to the experience as what's being served. And sometimes, with a little luck, you might even catch some live music coming out of the secluded gardens or the cozy parlors. We hiked beautiful scenery, visited locals cultivating wine in this city, and it led us here to an evening with friends, food, and music. You can go to our channel and hit subscribe to see more. Until then, I'm Medea, Siavis, and love from Vienna. <laughs>